All right, welcome back. This is my Rocket PDX. Uh, you got Tony commenting, and uh, behind the controls, it's my brother Daniel. Hello again. Let's return to the oldest house. Yeah. We had a couple week uh, interruption, so. Yeah. Gotta, I gotta figure my shit out. Uh, we are okay. Speak with Marshall. Oh, uh, just back. In, you can just fast travel there. I think we were trying to knock out some side stuff. Yeah, and I failed one of them, I remember. Yeah, it happens. So, Marshall's back to Central Executive. Oops. Yeah, that's an easy fast travel, we'll just get back on track. Wait. New board countermeasure, survival tactics. Oh, cool. it's completed, so you just get the reward. Nice. Hell yeah. It's Charged. a level one mod. Terrible. Okay. Oh, great. Thanks for nothing. <laughs> um, Should I uh, select another one? Sure, yeah. Might as well have them active. Like, why not? Um, charges the shotgun? Or Which? is it? I think. I can't remember. I don't know. That's Shatter. Which one's Charge? Is that the sniper? I don't know. Because I think I'm just. I only really like the first gun and the shotgun. So if it's not either one of those, I'm probably not going to use it. Uh, or charged maneuvers. Oh. Incursion charge. Using charge, kill enemies. So, is that... I don't know if I have that ability yet, unless that's... Uh... What, is char what is the charge power? Other than, like... Can you, can you dash forward? Is that what they're talking about? I'm confused. It has been a minute. Sorry, people. If you're here for expert... Um, Game advice. This is not it. I don't think that does damage to them, though. It, just... I think it'll do a moderate. It's mostly will disrupt them. So I'm not sure what they're talking about. Um, go back, and then go to Astral Constructs. Click on that weapon forms. Um, let's contract and spin back out. Back all the way out. Back out. And hit. Yeah, and then click on the gun. Which one? It doesn't matter. Okay. I don't remember. Um, there's a menu where you can select powers. Maybe, maybe one of these. Is... Is this launch? Yeah, it's not launch. Charge. Hmm. God, I am... I do not remember. Whatever. Just... Let's just move on. Just fast, fast travel to Marshall, executive. I just got all the power names. Um, energy, launch melee. Shield. Seize. Yeah. So, I don't know what it's talking about with charge. Because it wasn't the name of any of the weapons, either. Yeah. So maybe it is the uh, dash... I guess, but you're right though, I don't remember killing people with it. Uh, so every, I don't have enough points to buy, probably. No, you're right with one point, yeah. You could, oh, wait, one can of those. Unlock shield. Sure. Which is not bad to have, I mean. Shield or. It, it'll deal with all the small arm stuff for you. She's. That's not the mind control. Yes, one, it is. is. It? Oh, it is, okay. Yeah, yeah. I'd really, probably rather have the shield. Yeah. I think shield is not, is, I mean... Because that's different than when you pick up stuff, because you could pick up debris and... Yeah, it's not launch. It's, yeah. it, 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 well, you do pick up debris, but you make a shield with it. Oh, yeah, yeah. And then later you can unlock where you, when you release it, you actually throw it at enemies. How do I use the shield? There you go. Oh. I feel like I messed around with this. Yeah, in our original playthrough. Well, you you went through the thing where you got your power, you know how yeah. it has you. Oh, but I didn't actually unlock it. No, oh, I had to buy it. Oh, okay. Well, that makes sense because I had the mind, I did the mind control one too. Yes. Oh, okay. Yes. I probably just didn't have the points to buy it. Probably. Uh, also, part of why red... we're doing side content. Is that where I am? Quarry entrance. Yeah, I think that's just where you are. Yeah. yeah, yeah. Uh, wow. I think uh, you, um, you need to go executive. This is the top. And then, yeah, I can see the yellow to let you know where you need to go. Executive, that's perfect. Right where you need to be. Bam. Is 
it's been a while. Like I haven't had a uh, remedy as deeply enmeshed in my brain, so I don't have like all the thoughts compiled. So if you, I don't know, I don't know if you're just looking at random stuff. I was listening to the NPC. Oh, sorry. Huh. It's a good point. There's uh, some of that uh, atmospheric story stuff just picked up that way. Well, the frequency thing's interesting. You know, in submarines, I don't know what generation of submarines, but they used to make noise. You know, the, the engines would be really annoying, but they found a frequency that would cancel it out. Oh, and so they admit a noise, and I mean, that... Kind yeah, of stuff. It's, it's just... like a noise canceling headphone for your diesel motor. Mm, yeah. yeah. But they just broadcast the right frequency and it wasn't annoying. Nice. Okay. Had to take a detour into the quarry, but I found plenty. Here. We will start HRA production immediately. I promised I'd tell you about Dylan once you helped us. This is it. She knows. Seventeen years I've waited. Your brother is here. He was once known as Prime Candidate Six, codenamed P6. We brought him here after the ordinary event. He was groomed to be the future director. He had talents far beyond any other candidate in the program. Of course he did. We found you together. We share a bond. Are you with him now? So you kidnapped him. We took him in. Your parents vanished along with every other adult in ordinary. Eventually, his power changed him. There were casualties. He wasn't fit to be the director. Did you know about this? Is this why you didn't bring me here sooner? Were you keeping me away? Where is Dylan? He's kept in the containment sector, in the Panopticon. My brother. I thought we were the same. What if we are? I'm going. Now. I expected as much. I need to go check on something. Something I cannot let the Hiss find. It shouldn't take long, but you must watch the Bureau while I'm gone. And remember, Dylan is dangerous. Do not let him out, Director Faden. How do I make her stop calling me that? I'm not here for them. Nothing simple here. These people took my brother, but they've accepted me without question. Are they my enemies or my friends? I need to see Dylan. I need to know. I wish you could tell me what you know, explain things. Just stay with me, okay? I could use a friend right now. So, Courtney Hope, who is Jesse Faden, um, actor, she was in Quantum Break, the Remedy game, um, came out between Alan Wake and, uh, I guess, this game, and uh, her brother Dylan was also an actor in Quantum Break. don't remember his name sorry dude um but yeah i like it remedy really tends to kind of keep its people around which is pretty fun a little tricky um when you are recasting them but that's why they went multiverse i guess kind of helps you deal with all that 
My brother's keeper. Jesse goes to containment sector to find the Panopticon where Dylan is held. Federal Bureau of Control. That's interesting. My brother's keeper. Jesse goes. Okay, that's just a mission briefing. I was going to say, I thought this was a weird. Not a, not a note, yeah. I thought it was like a weird Alan Wake style thing, writing something that, like, was going to happen in the future. Yeah. I was like, what is going on? <laughs> okay, it's just a mission briefing. Got it. All right. <laughs> um, and this is just some side stuff you can pick up. Some, oh, hotline. Control point. Oh, here we go. Astral now. Okay. Nice. Interesting. The voice from the other side explaining how to use game mechanics. I like it. Which one of these should you I tackle next, do you think? Uh, executive and research. So they're both in places you're not going. Okay. So... Um, so I either have to go out of my way or... Can you just activate them both? Or can you only... Have, I think... I, can't I don't really, know. It doesn't seem like I can... Oh, are they just them. active? They might yeah. just be active already. Yeah. Okay. Then, then it's up to you, like, what you want to tackle. If you want to go after the main mission or if you want to go after the... Countermeasures see, or rewards or random where level three mod. I mean, that's a pretty good. I'd probably want to do this one because it's a level three mod. This one's only a level two. And I think you'll get experience along the way. I think. So this so one kill his it's the executive sector using shatter. I like using shatter, so that's an easy. Mm -hmm. And even if the mods are not good, you can melt the mods down for the spikes, mm -hmm. whatever they call it. The Energon crystals. Yeah, so executive sector. And it doesn't really say kill his rangers, so I don't know. I have to kill. Oh, five. They're in the bar there. Okay. Well, let's just go do that. So I need to go. So you're already in executive, so you just gotta go just find where they'll spawn. Which is probably either north or south of this. Doesn't yeah. Like it makes sense. Okay. Pretty much anywhere in here, I imagine. Should do it. I can't do the dash. Mm -hmm. as long as they have. Yeah, this is a safe zone. The dash must do damage if they won't let me do it. I'm gonna find some rangers. This is a pretty decent chunk of energy. Yeah. Damn. Yeah. So much destruction. Everything's expensive. Can you open what? that now? Yeah. Level 5 mod. Level 5. No. <laughs> Agent death notification? You missed the message. Correspondence. Hit triangle. Okay. Federal Bureau of Control. Do Dear Mr. and Mrs. Potts, I regret to inform you that your son, Graham Potts, was killed in active duty this past week. While the details surrounding his death are classified, I am honored to tell you that he died in service of his country. You can be proud of his courage in the face of danger and his commitment to protecting our nation against her enemies. He will be remembered by his comrades and colleagues. I sincerely regret the pain this message will bring you. Take some solace in knowing that his sacrifice helped protect the country he loves so much. His effects will be returned to you with all speed. Sincerely yours, Howard J. Murray, Deputy Chief of Communications, Federal Bureau of Control. Nice little touch about the costs of your lackeys in the meat grinder. Hmm. Probably melt that level one. They're going to use that. I'd rather probably have that accuracy boost. Ammo for exclusive shatter smash. Yep, you have an available slot, so you can literally just add a one. Oh, that's exactly what I'm trying to do. Oh, okay, gotcha. Yeah, but, but you I only have three. three okay. Yeah. 
So I think I'm gonna go with the accuracy boost. Wish there was ammo. an option to hide mods that can't be applied to the weapon. Ammo efficiency is kind of tempting. Sure. The rate of fire, I'm not too worried about that because I'd rather be more, excuse me, accurate. Mm, yeah. More, more targets, uh, rounds that hit is better than speed. Sure. What's this one? That's uh, extra projectiles. Oh. That's cool, but let's see here. That's just a weaker version of what you already have. Yeah, I should melt that down. Yes. This one is okay, reduce the spread so the tighter choke on it. Ooh. That's. I like that actually. This one is ammo efficiency. I'm going with that. I like that. Okay. Okay. Alright, enough of that. Am I getting too far away? Uh, yeah, these just might not be areas that enemies spawn in. Now you're back in the boardroom. Oh, can you open all the four? Yes. Ah, oh, nice. The posted room. Federal Bureau of Control, to whom it may concern, in case you are not aware, something caused the sticky note room in my office to duplicate. My office is unusable now. I will be working from home until this is resolved can reach me on my cell or home phone. Sincerely, J. Bozer, Vice Chief of Staff. Hmm. Oh. Is a sticky note in my office duplicate? Hmm. I'm not really sure what that means. This is, has a billion sticky notes. Oh, oh, okay. So does he think that the, this room is now like a liability? Yeah, I guess so. This is uh, maybe he's just too weirded out by it. Pierce, you don't have Pierce, so that's fine. And the other is just an upgrade material. And you're back in the main boardroom. Uh, if you head toward, um, I don't know, like say the mail room or oh hey. Look at this. I think you like, gotta hold it down, yeah. I just now realized. <laughs> all right, Federal Bureau of Control, hello. As you all should know by now, the R4 reports are due by the end of the week. We're still waiting on them from a number of people. If you need an extension, please request form R4.E from your supervisor. If you think you're exempt from filing an R4, then you'll need to get written permission from your department chief saying so. Remember, R4s are mandatory under Section 75.2 of the Employee Manual. If your R4 requires interdepartmental claims, then please contact the appropriate department head, Dr. Darling, Ms. Marshall, Mr. Salvador, or Mr. Kirkland, as needed. They'll be, they'll be busy on Thursday in their annual policy review, so please schedule accordingly. Best, your admin team. So it's just, you know, peek into the bureaucracy. Federal Bureau of Control is definitely a bureaucracy. Uh, so some, uh, your evade bad. efficiency, nice, okay. Huh. So you dodge better. Versus? That's recovery, so you heal more from your pickups. Ugh. I like my mods, even though that's a higher level mod. Yeah. That's right. I think with a few more skill points, we'll level up to be able to add another slot. Yeah, that would definitely be a good third slot mod. So. Yeah, I think it gathered everything there. Nice and messy. Federal Bureau of Control, agenda item for next executive meeting. Rising costs of AWE response, update on mold eradication efforts, upcoming annual salary review, new supplier of coffee filters to be found and vetted. Please come prepared. Thank you for your time. 
Okay, so again, just getting more peeks into the bureaucratic side of things. A little bit more of the mundane office management stuff. Yeah, mundane was going to be the key word mm -hmm. I was seeing there. Just start it and then, yeah, do that. Reminder, if you experience an unanticipated building shift, follow these simple steps. One, search the room for any altered items or objects of power. Two, carry the altered item or object of power to the nearest safe room. Three, wait for bureau staff to find you and the object. If there are no altered items or objects of power in the vicinity, then, reach your supervisor via the nearest intercom and await further instructions. Thank you for your attention. No, thank you. Is that the scientist guy's voice? No. If you experience I don't think so. Yeah, it just says FBC spokesman. Yeah, I wonder if it's the same one that was complaining about having his voice used. Two, carry the altered item or object of power to the nearest safe room. Bash. Yeah, that's a short term thing. Oops. Uh, nope. There we go. Alright, dinner reservations at 7 p.m. at Chez Umbre. Wife will meet you there. Don't be late. Flowers are ready for you at the lobby reception. Remember, she's turning 46. Almost like a Mad Men esque note from your secretary. Yeah. Yeah, they're mold problem. <laughs> Daily body checks? Like they're getting mold on themselves? Well, when you see, you'll understand. <laughs> I mean, you already saw a couple of the rooms. Actually, yeah. maybe you've already... I don't remember. Do you remember? Have you encountered the, the I mold? I think so. Right, well. Or at least it doesn't ring a bell. You'll, you'll know when you know. Is that the way I can? Yeah. Alright, you need to head I need to, to go to the opposite direction. We be out there. Think so, yeah, I think I should go north. Yeah, go down one of these ways. Ooh. Oh, ooh, ooh. oh. This is like all the things we've been ignoring. Examination of paranatural topics, objects of power and their per per utility. Okay. This is a very basic thing that we should have ran into a long time ago apparently. Mm. Alright, summary. Objects of power are unique in their capacity to grant certain individuals paranatural abilities. We call these individuals para-utilitarians. The potency of the abilities depends on the para-utilitarian. Using the redacted object of power as an example, some para-utilitarians can achieve a throw distance of redacted, while others are only capable of of as little as redacted. See Dr. Darling's presentation 11.15 for more information. What exactly determines an individual's paranatural competence is unknown, but it is largely believed that some redacted exist within the body and that, like all muscles, it can be exercised. To continue my analysis, I have officially requested access to Northmore Records. Considering he is one of the most accomplished para-utilitarians the Bureau has ever seen, Dr. Darling is still considering this request. Refer to file 8-54-192 for full report. Northmore, I'm not positive, I might be mixing up people, um, but I think he's the one that's inside the reactor. Oh, yeah. I wonder if some of these notes are written by her brother. Maybe. Depends on how active he was, I guess. He's been before he for 17 went years. crazy. Okay, that's just the boardroom. So, if you go through the door, the left. Uh, I guess you can talk to her about something. It's interesting. Analysis of the Hiss threat, part two. Researchers. Oh, my bad. 
<laughs> where Sentu transcribed the recursive chant repeated by the his entities. In interest of safety, this was done with non-aggressive floating his entities. However, no distinction between this repeating phrase and the one repeated by the more violent his entities has been observed. What is the purpose of this repeating string of words? Is this how the his corrupts, corrupts individuals? Does the chant produce a physical effect? Is it a message, an incantation? We were able to record a we were <laughs> we were able to record a first down recitation of the chanting. See corresponding audio rec record. Refer to file redacted for full report. Okay. Yeah, I mean that part's definitely creepy and confusing. <laughs> I feel like she's gonna give me a mission. Well, I mean it's fine because it's all nonlinear for the most part. Jesse, when you were down in research, did you run into a Dr. Rhea Underhill? I didn't. No. Who is she? She was, is, a colleague of mine. A researcher studying a kind of extra-dimensional mold growing below research. Well, I don't like the sound of that. No one does. Look, I haven't heard from Rhea since the Hiss arrived. Would you mind having a look around for her next time you're in research? Of course. Thanks, Jesse. Now, what's on your mind? I wonder if that conversation would have gone differently if you had met her. Yeah. It did feel like there was some room for different answers. I visited the quarry. What's the plan for all that Blackrock? The Bureau has used Blackrock almost exclusively for containment purposes. See, I say, branch out. Instead of boxes, helmets. Instead of blast shields, knives. Knives? Yes, knives! So many combat applications! Slicing, stabbing, gouging! Sorry. I've been trying to get Darling to explore combat applications for years. I've got a little excited. Wow. I did not expect that from her. I should be going. Enjoy your data. Oh, I will. Mm -hmm. Okay. All right. I think that if you go down the, the door to the right there, that'll get you to like toward the mail room or something. Should you get your enemy spawns that down that way? Oh, and you have you have a temp mission selected. We can, which I guess doesn't matter, but. If you actually select the mission you're trying to do, it'll show your account. So you gotta go, the, yeah, that one. Except that didn't do it. So hopefully some ranger spawn. You gotta take them out with shatter. Is that the? Yeah. Okay. Don't forget you have shield and you know, a million other powers now. But I need to shield. Well, kill it. Shield will just protect you for now. You don't have the offensive upgrade on it. These guys aren't even rangers. I forgot. Are they just like considered guards? I think so. No, they're rangers. Oh, they are. Because we have the rocket launcher. Oh my god. Uh, definitely. There, there are several different ranger types. Oh yeah. Yep. Making progress. Nice. Maybe, maybe the first guy you took out wasn't technically a ranger. Maybe I don't know. Oh, I killed him. Oh, I didn't expect that to kill him. I thought it would just soften him a little bit. I think that's a ring. Yeah, that's a ring for sure. Yeah. Gotta let him get closer. Yeah, they're getting a yell hat, I don't know, maybe not. Perfect. 
forgot how to crouch. <laughs> yeah, I, I, <laughs> I feel like was surprised when you crouched. I was like, what? <laughs> oh, it's R3. It's a, it's a, it's useful. Yeah. And I don't have to hold it, I just tap it. Originally they were going to make this into a cover shooter. A what? A cover shooter. Oh, uh, yeah. I mean, you can, technically. Yeah, it's still got a little bit. It's a little of clunky, but... I want to say they had a cover shooter mechanic. It'd be nice if you return to cover after you, like, let go of the aim button. Yeah. I think they just kind of gave up on it after they realized that the oh. of your powers went, meant, like, being aggressive. Where is this guy? He just, like, nailed you. Oh, I need to fucking switch it on down. Oh, wow. What a jerk. Does that mean I fail that mission? I don't think so. I think only the temporary ones can fail. What a bad. I think. I think these. At worst, maybe it reset? I mean, I'm fine with it resetting. Oh, okay, it's still there. Oh, it's completed. Wait, is it? Countermeasure is completed. Go to central okay, executive and collect your ward. Yeah, 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 you just gotta activate the control point. And then you can turn it in. Board countermeasure. Okay. You got a, a charge maneuver. Okay. What the fuck are charge maneuvers? So confusing. Kill enemies in executive film. Main excursion his charged. The award for this kind of sucks. Random absolute weapon mod. What That's is absolute? Level five of those, like the. High, well, I think there's technically is that a level different, six later, but like. Absolute a different gun. But. It says random absolute weapon mod. I'm guessing that's a different gun. Uh, no, I think absolute's the name for the level. Like level five is. Oh. Okay. Weirdly named absolute. So I need to kill his warped. I don't remember what the, the warped, warped uh, might just be the the really big guys that have like the telekinetic power. Huh. Maintenance incursion headshot tactics using pierce kill enemies. We don't have pierce unlocked. Yeah. Uh. Using charge. Kill enemies and exactly. I guess we could try it. I mean, I could try it using the, the rush. I'm so confused. Sector elevator. Because the normal gun's called grip, so. Yeah. Charge is. Oops. I wonder if charge is the rocket launcher. Or grenade. What if, yeah, the rocket launcher. Maybe that's what it is. thing in the game.
rockets like going out of the top. You unlock, you unlock the levitate power, right? No, no. I'm still yet to do that. Got it. Yeah, okay. Alright. They're still around, aren't they? No. The music cut out, oh. so... Oh, nice. Please be aware, due to recent fluctuations in the nearest control point, this area's stability has been downgraded to yellow. Reference chart, green stable, yellow low possibility of unanticipated building shifts, orange high likelihood of an unanticipated building shifts, red frequent unanticipated building shifts. Nice. Man, couldn't imagine taking a number two and having a code red building shift situation going on. Yeah. I think they actually explore that. Oh man. Oh. Crafting material. Yeah. Oh wait. That's a. Oh, yeah, it's it's totally is. Yeah. Just kidding at first. All right. Um. So. I think you have a thing in a totally different sector. Right. I think you already completed the stuff in executive. Or am I... What did you have? Uh, yeah, this one, charge... So I think charge is actually a weapon that you just don't have unlocked. It's it's like the rocket launcher or something like that. Okay. So you can't even do that. So so you can either move... Okay, there's others. Uh, so you can move to research. This one, I think, is just anywhere. The second one. And uh, so either go to research or just get back on the main mission. Yeah. And w or, I mean, yeah, these are side things. Well, no, no, no. My Brother's Keeper is your main mission. Is it the old grud? Uh, you can. Absolutely, I guess. Yeah. It's, yeah. So wait, I need to go to... I would say the boss in it is, is pretty tough. So you don't have to take on the boss yet, but you can definitely explore the place down there. There's a number of missions you'll get from it. Yeah, you can teleport there. You just have to get the... Dead letters is an orange. Oh, yeah, yeah, it's right in front of you. It's right, right there. Except oh. you, you might get an enemy spawn as soon as you go up there, though. That would go around. Oh, I know, but I'm kind of curious. I haven't been here in a while. Oh, okay. No worries. I, I figured there's probably some key cards that I didn't have before. Uh, yeah, yeah, you know, maybe. It doesn't look like, uh, maybe there's much exploring to do here, like I thought. This is all a control point now. I don't think I'll get attacked here. Oh, here we go. Uh, I don't know, maybe. Never mind, it looks like Hard to say. Yeah, this looks really thoroughly explored. Ooh, I unlocked some skill points. Uh... That's cool. That's cool. Energon. Yeah. Sure. Base tank things better. Yeah. Oh, I just, uh, additional personal mod yeah. spot too. Yeah, nice. So you have all three. So you can apply a whole extra. So you have a uh, evade efficiency, looks like you have launch efficiency, and um, what's your other number four there? That is uh, energy, okay, it looks like you can melt some like level ones, so I'm never gonna probably get rid of some of these level twos. Nice. Okay. 
Okay. Wait, what's this one again? Hmm. That's kind of tempting. Overall Energy increased. recovery speed. I don't know, that's a pretty high number. Yeah, mm -hmm. never mind. You got a level four. What is, oh, it's not for the right weapon, though. Yeah. For spin. This one. Oh, that's the wrong weapon, too. All of these are the wrong weapon. Shatter grab. This one's ammo efficiency. Meh. 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 Mm-hmm. Uh, where am I going again? It was central. You want to either go to research, or you want to go to... Um, uh, wherever the panopticon is. Central research, right? Is that if you're doing that, yeah, that's what you get selected. So that, yes, you yeah, want to go yeah. to central research. Yes. There we go. So it's down at the bottom. I need to go south. You just no, you just need to like literally go down. Straight oh. down. Well oh, that looks like a bad idea. Yeah, there's should be a I don't know if it's this way, but there should be a way down. What's that? Oh, that's the elevator. I think that takes you That'd be convenient if this works out the way I want it to. I'm just gonna probably just be like, like... Oh yeah, okay. So let's do... Uh, that way. So down to the right is the entrance to where you need to go. Some enemies around somewhere. See if I hadn't had guessed this is this is on track. This is what? You're on track. Okay. Oh. So I'm back. Oh another wave.
No, don't turn around. <laughs> Hi, Carla. Does it strike you as odd that Darling insists on having us appear in those bizarre videos of his? I mean, we just stand there. He doesn't even let us have lines or anything. Don't get me wrong. Beats a day in the lab. Plus, it's always great to work with you. Oh yeah, I finished the co a comparative analysis of the two black rock samples you sent. The prism, or whatever you called it. I filed them in the usual place, under C for Carla. A handy mnemonic device, right? Haha. -ha. Anyway. Let me know if there's anything you want to discuss about the data. I, I'll gladly explain. Maybe we could chat about it over some drinks or dinner even. I can't remember the last time I had a good steak. Maybe we could go together after work sometime. I'm free tomorrow. All my best, Hubert. Aww, inner office romance. All right. I hope Carla's picking up what he's putting down. Uh, cool. Uh, nope, not even for that guy. Mm -hmm. And that's <laughs> some trash. Just no thanks. You literally had a better level of it anyway. Yeah. Okay. All right, time to go down to the creepy mold hole. Yeah. Sorry, I'm a. No, that's but, fine. There's, there's exploration here. It's all good. Assuming you haven't been in here. Got a low health boost. Doesn't sound promising. There's a ridiculous amount of stuff on this level. You'll need level cage to reach all of it, though. Hmm. Uh, N slash A, so like not applicable. AWE 18, event summary. A possible AWE in which an unnamed individual experienced transcorporeality via a phone line. Event is notably similar to AWE, AWE Redacted, in which Redacted Redacted. Event response. Event is believed to have been caused by Redacted. Redacted end result. The following measures have been taken to prevent Redacted, colon, Redacted, Redacted, Redacted. That's fascinating. There's a lot, but not there. Mm-hmm. Oh, what's this? Uh, low health boost. Yeah, no, I don't care about that. Wow. wow, that's a huge amount, though. 78%. Nice. But, I don't know. I, don't know. I hate that, because, like, why would I want to uh -huh. hang out with my health, though? Well, So I was just wondering about the plants and research. Is it really necessary to sing to them? I mean, that janitor does have a nice voice, and the plants sure seem to like it. Maybe he could just switch it up a bit? I'm getting pretty tired of the tango. And where did these plants even come from? No one seems to remember when they were planted. And people like them a bit too much, if you ask me. Are we being invaded by houseplants? Worth looking into, Dr. Lewis. I think you already did that side objective, where you had to talk to the plants. Hmm. I don't know. Maybe, maybe you did, maybe you didn't. I don't know. Oh, oh, oh. Dude, gnarly. Play the video? Yeah. Oh. Okay. 
glimpse into the paranatural synchronicity and the unseen connections. Synchronicity is a phenomenon long recognized by the wise, but only recently given a name by science. It is how we rationalize events connected by no identifiable causality, yet clearly conjoined in purpose. How does a dream foretell an event in the physical plane? Why do hounds bail at the death of their master, which has occurred miles away? The world is unified in ways we do not yet understand, and sometimes we stumble across these invisible, unseen chords and wonder at the result. The visionary Carl Jung laid the broad, uh, laid the road. Now we must walk it. My fledgling research department will make it our mission to reliably re reproduce redacted behavior by the close of 1959. Once done, the mechanics of synchronicity will lay themselves bare in due time. We are striding into the future of science. History may, may, not, may not remember our names, but God himself will. Refer to file redacted for full report. Yeah, so the whole Jungian archetypes and all that stuff, it's major influence on all of control and remedy in general. Huh. That and like the zeitgeist kind of concepts of a sort of a almost viral sharing of ideas. That's the hotel, I think. Oh, is that a? I think that's a picture from inside of the hotel. Yeah, the Oceanside. Oceanside. Yeah, okay. Ocean, Oceanside Motel. Yeah. Maybe. Looks like it. Could be. That'd be interesting. Makes some sense. Oh, that was cool. Yeah, see, I think you need levitate to get to that. That's straight across. Straight across. Yeah, yeah. You need levitate to get there. There's like a yeah, a bunch of all that stuff up there. You need levitate. Research. You're supposed to kill people in research. Is there a particular like thing you had to follow to do to do it? You're in research. You need to kill snipers. Oh, well, there've been no sniper spawning, so that's kind of useful. Oh, okay. Gotta kill that hard thing too. Trying to do the mind control thing. or something. Yeah, here we go. 
Uh, utilization of something elements threshold <laughs> threshold have, have always been a source. Or sorry, thresholds have always been sources of great inspiration and great challenge. When a new threshold manifests in the oldest house by redacted, we never know what new discoveries will provide to the bureau. But we must always seize these opportunities. This report will examine the process distinguishing recent threshold effects based on their utilitarian possibilities. The quarry brought the black rock, one of our most invaluable discoveries. But if the mold has any scientific value, it has been difficult to find due to the links of we must go to in fighting back the, partic the particularly prolific plant. These are very distinct cases of worth comparing as their study offers vastly different dangers and rewards. Refer to file 5-94-1284 for full report. Levitate, you gotta, yeah, use the, you gotta use the, the terrain to not die falling. Okay. Oh, yeah, huh. you can go down there. You've already been over here. You've been in there. Okay. Yep. But you can go through uh, the door. Okay. So I have. So uh, you can uh, go in here, but if you turn the music on, it'll cause a problem. <laughs> so <laughs> you can't do it. Oh. But yeah, this is just an Easter egg for the band. Oh, I see what you're saying, like a copyright problem. Yeah. Gotcha. It's unfortunate, but yeah, it'll it'll cause a issue. Gotcha. 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 So that's that button. It might, yeah, it might just be a, um, like a unenforced copy rate thing. I don't know, but it's just safer to just not mess with it. Gotcha. There's one song later, and it might be the same problem, but it's, it's just too epic to, like, not let it happen, so. so close to wrapping up we might as well just wrap up yeah okay all right uh so this has been uh control um on morocopedia x this is uh tony narrating and uh, behind the controls is daniel we'll be back soon thank you